Hello all, Shoestring here. Today we're going to talk about putting two lithium batteries in parallel. And not just two lithium batteries, but two lithium batteries that are not made by the same company. A lot of folks have asked me, can you do that? And the answer is, yes, I do it. And it works. Generally, they tell you it must be made from the same company, same type, and bought 30 days with within the sale of each one. But that isn't necessarily true because a lot of us can't afford to do that. So I'm going to show you what you need to do to make this work. So first off, we do need two batteries that are close to the same chemistry. So here we have two batteries. They are both LiPo4, both LiPo4. We do want to make sure that they both have the same voltage and the same amp hours. You can put different amp amperages together in parallel, but it doesn't work very efficiently. And I don't suggest you do that. But this way works just fine. So let's walk through a couple of the steps before we put them together. First thing you need to do is charge each one up individually. Charge it all the way up, then let it set for a couple hours. Because once you charge it, it will be 14.3, 14.6 or so. And But you want to let it drop to its sitting voltage would normally be around 13.4, 13.6. Each one individually charged all the way up, then we're going to let it sit, which has already been done to these. Now, to do parallel, what we're talking about in parallel is that each battery together is 12 volts, and then when we put them together, they will remain 12 volts, but they will have amp hours of both combined. So what I'm saying is 12 volts, both of these are, and they're both 100 amp hours. When we're finished, it will be 12 volts, 200 amp hours. It will double your time. How we do that is we put these batteries together and we're gonna do positive to positive. Now, you wanna keep the wires, cables. I use wires and cables interchangeably, so don't worry about it. Wires, cables, either one. You want to keep them as short as possible. These are just a little bit long because I'm doing it for demonstration purposes. But you want to keep these as short as possible. And you want to get them tight. These I'm just doing finger tight because, like I said, I'm just showing you, demonstrating how to do this. Okay, they are now in parallel. Once they're put together in parallel, black to black and red to red, what you want to do now is charge them again. Put them on a battery charger, use solar, whatever you want. Charge them up to full power, full charge again. Then unhook them. And it should be ready to go and they'll work together. So whatever you do to one battery will happen to the other battery. So this one here has a LED smart battery monitor. It will now, and I know this because I've tested it, will now monitor both batteries at the same level at the same time. Also, if you charge or discharge these, they will charge and discharge at the same time, which is very important and at the same rate. You can do this with these type of batteries up to four. So you can have up to 400 amp hours with this system. And it doesn't cost a lot because these, I've reviewed both of these before, so I know they work well. These are inexpensive batteries that cost you right around $200. So for lithium, that's not bad. So, that's how this works. If you have any questions, put it down in the comments. I'll put a link to these two batteries, by the way, in the description if you're interested in either one of those. 
If you like this, please like, subscribe, share it with someone who you think might like it, and shoestring out.